Joining us now is the sheriff of Jacksonville, TK Waters. Sheriff Waters, thank you so much for joining us here on GMA. Last night, you said you had not been able to identify the shooter. Are you any closer this morning? Yeah, we're, we're very close. Uh, we were close late last night. Um, I should have some results today to release to the public. Okay, and we'll be watching for that. And, and you say this was a racially motivated crime, that there were swastikas on the shooter's guns, and you also found some of his writings. What can you tell us about those? Um, they were, quite frankly, writings of a madman. They were um, the uh, rather liberal use of the N-word uh, several times. Um, it was clear that they, they, his crimes were motivated by wanting to, uh, wanting to shoot black people. Um, which is quite unfortunate because it's not a representative of our community at all um, and uh, quite disturbing. Uh, but we're making our way through that and um, continue to investigate the causes of, of, of this incident. And, you know, there was a chilling story we heard overnight. We learned that earlier that night there was an encounter between the shooter and a campus security officer over at Edward Waters University. That's an HBCU, a historically black university. But he left that campus and then went to Dollar General, where, of course, he carried out that shooting. Do you have any idea why he left and instead chose the store? Uh, from what I know right now, it appears, <clears throat> excuse me, it appears he just went there and put on his, his uh, vest, his uh, bulletproof vest, um, put a mask on and, and armed himself, got in his vehicle and went to uh, Dollar General. I think he was looking for the first place where he could stop that was occupied and um, to, uh, to commit this horrific act. Yeah, that campus security officer perhaps saving uh, countless more lives. Sheriff Waters, thank you for joining us here. Our hearts are with your community, of course, and we thank you for all you do. Thank you very much. Thanks for having me. Absolutely. Take care, sir. Hi everyone, George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.